have the Xiaomi Mi 9 here with me today and it will be undergoing a charging speed test on my channel as I have previously done. I usually compare devices to other phones out there but unfortunately I don't have any to compare them to but I will definitely throw in results that I have previously done beforehand. Now this is paired with a 27 watt fast wireless charger that comes straight out the box with its respective USB Type-C cable and it is not the highest and the best and the biggest charging block out there but it is certainly Xiaomi's biggest to date. So let's test this out. My name's Technic and without further ado, let's go. So I have put my trustworthy S8 on the side of it running as a stopwatch to check different timers and the phone thankfully didn't turn on when I plugged in the charging cable just like many Honors and Huawei phones do do. Hence, this is a Xiaomi phone, so I'm actually really grateful to see that so that we can be more accurate with this test. Now, after the first 10 minutes, we have 27% of juice from 0%. After 10 minutes, guys, that is like super VOOC territory right there. Okay, maybe not VOOC territory like seen on the Oppo, which can get the phone full in 35 minutes, but it is still really impressive to say at least in 15 minutes, pretty much 40%. I mean... If that doesn't impress you, I don't know what will, guys. Xiaomi have never been one for fast charging. And now they've brought fast wireless charging, which I'll also be setting up soon. So 20 minutes, 51%, guys. You can get 50% of battery charging time after just 20 minutes of charging your Mi 9. I mean, that is... That, that just blows my mind to see that considering the Mix 3 has a slightly smaller battery and after 30 minutes, it only did like 40%. And oh, 30 minutes, 71%. Guys, you can almost charge your phone full. This is almost super VOOC territory in just 30 minutes. And yes, Xiaomi could have made the charging block bigger. And yes, it would have charged faster. But is there really going to be a huge difference in your life if it can charge 20 minutes faster when they would rather cut the cost down and still give you great charging times? 87% after 40 minutes. It's almost full after just 40 minutes of charge, guys. The Huawei Mate 20 Pro promised after 40 minutes you'll get 70% and this is almost 90%, but bear in mind that has a 900 milliampere battery higher in difference there. 91% after 45 minutes, just a quarter, an hour to go and we'll be hitting that hour mark. Let's see if it's gonna stack up there. Do you guys think it will hit it in less than an hour? We're hitting 95% after just 50 minutes, guys. This is faster definitely than the Honor Magic 2, which I said was the fastest to date that I've seen that did it in just under an hour with a 3,500 milliampere battery, 97% in 55 minutes, and that did it in just under an hour with a 40 watt charging block. So it is a bigger charging block and it only has a 200 bigger milliampere battery. So I think it kind of outweighs if this beats that, and I think it will. And here it comes 99% and 100% 59 minutes guys just under an hour. I'm ridiculously impressed with this phone I'm really happy with what Xiaomi have done here. Good job Xiaomi and this is what you want to see This is a step in the right direction for Xiaomi I'm really pleased to say that this has really made me enjoy the phone a lot more now guys This is the Xiaomi Mi 9 charging speed test We'll have to see what it does with its battery drain test Which I'll be bringing you guys as quickly as I can as soon as I get my hands on a Samsung Galaxy S10 Plus and then we'll put them head-to-head -head against each other to see what they can do there I really hope you guys enjoyed this video as much as I did making it um, and stay tuned for its full review, which will be up very, very shortly. Until next time, guys, this is Technic.